Hey guys, what's up? It's Shar, and welcome back to my Sims 4 LP. So here we are with the Sims. We are outside on the back patio, just trying to enjoy some light, some sunlight, some rays beaming down on us. We sure enough cannot get that inside the house. Okay, let me tell you, <laughs> I thought they were going to be eating a bunch of cereal this morning, but turns out they have a freaking grill out back. How amazing is that? They have a grill, so that's perfect. So it's not always the best to eat grilled fruit food it's not always best to eat grilled food every day but you know miles thought it'd be nice to go ahead and just make a decent meal for everybody and since he has his son why not um take the opportunity to like you know try to make our son a good meal because you know we can cook <laughs> Um, yeah, we can cook some grilled fruit, you know, whatever. <laughs> but anyway, so China is over here giving Miles the stink eye. Apparently, she doesn't like him standing too close to her. <laughs> but, um, I'm going to go ahead and have Wendell, um, go and collect these since I saw these earlier. And we do have a, a onion plant over here, but I don't think we need any onions. So I'm going to go ahead and let them eat. Hopefully they will, yeah. So you guys go ahead and do that, and I want to talk to you all for a little bit. So first thing is first, I went ahead and decided to add a little bit of extra space here in the kitchen. Um, again, I, it's not to say that I'm going to keep this area. I really have no idea, but um, for now, this space was really, really empty. It was really, really bothering me, so I kind of changed the whole layout. And I removed the door that was here and I placed a new one here. I also moved the computer, added some paintings that um, Miles still had in his inventory and um, added a trash can and things like that. The um, next thing is I was finally able to fix this door. Apparently there was an issue with the foundation and whatever the case may be, it just wasn't allowing the Sims to even get up the steps and even through the house once I deleted the door out back because originally I was oh god this chick this what do you want oh, I guess she wants to go on a trip huh <laughs> pause excuse us um so yes yeah, so I was able to fix the foundation um it was a lot wider I do believe or it came out further so I just deleted it and um just placed a new one here re uh rearranged the steps or I gave them some new steps I can't remember and um I also got rid of a wall a door that was here i don't know it kind of seemed weird to me so i just kind of removed that and then there is a glimpse of wendell's bed right there so that's pretty much it so i guess zoe is here because she's expecting to come with us see this is what i was talking about in the last part or the previous part before the last part like she is constantly stalking miles and i did change her hair i really do like this hair that came with outdoor retreat it's really really cute but she's getting on my nerves i don't really understand what it is she's like hey babe i'm all ready to go i'm ready to go with you guys yo yeah, girl bye please <laughs> like we supposed to have our son for the freaking you know three days that we have and here she is like stopping by like the day of you know just coming just coming over here um don't read a handiness book because we are about to leave go ahead and chillax i guess what are you doing christian what are you doing is did you grab another plate oh my, oh my goodness i christian are you kidding me right you are holding us up oh my and her in this voodoo doll i swear look at that <laughs> These sims are a hot mess. And she giving him attitude, be yelled at. Oh my goodness. China, seriously? Seriously, are you going to do this right now? I bet you she's still mad about Liberty. <laughs> she's, what are you doing? Do, do sit-ups. Where are you? Child, please. You are out here with your pajamas on. <laughs> Speaking of his pajamas, look at his face. <laughs> he has some space pajamas. I thought they were really cute. Um, Can you please get up? can you go home like seriously what is going on change change your clothes put on put something on put put something you know what let's see what do you have um let's do everyday two um whatever that's fine <laughs> these sims are ridiculous oh my god just like his father i tell you look <laughs> 
you know, his son's out there doing freaking sit-ups in the middle of nowhere. And his his dad is in here doing push-ups. You know, they are just two of a kind, I tell you. All right. So pause this really quickly. And let's go ahead and throw this plate away. And are there other plates out here? No. Okay. So somebody cleaned it up. I don't know. Christian, seriously. My goodness. So we're going to go ahead and take a trip to Granite Falls. We are going to go with... um the house um i know zoe wants to tag along and you know should we bring zoe should we bring zoe i don't know should we bring her i have no idea i no <laughs> no we are not bringing her so also before i do that there was another there was another issue that I came across, which was the refrigerator. So I actually found out that The Sims could indeed make a garden salad, but every time I click on it, I had this weird glitch where I would like click on the food and then it would just take the money and The Sim just would not, you know, make the food. It was just really, really weird. But anyways, yeah, I changed the door back here. I added a little table set out back. Um, and that was the only thing I believe. So we're going to stay for three days and I also downloaded this lot from the gallery and I do remember I told somebody that I was going to try to showcase the house that they have and um, show you guys where I got that from so I'll try to see if I can do that so this is the house right here it is the Renaissance Villa it is by Soulful Essence and the lot is furnished it looks a little bit different than how I have it you guys might like the way that it's already furnished but um I had to get rid of a lot of items so that my sims could actually move into this house and um so that is that so we are finally here in Granite Falls we just got here just landed and it is absolutely gorgeous I I love it I have this snow mod that um I got for this world I think is absolutely perfect definitely brings a little bit of um differentiation to the world um coming from oasis springs and all that jazz so if you are curious about this mod and where to get it from you can definitely find it on mod the sims and um yeah so anyways this is the cabinet they're going to be staying in i think it's really cute um this is what it looks like it's fairly it's it's pretty small to be honest oh so they don't even need a tent okay well that's awesome so this comes with everything okay cool well that saves us money because we do not have it <laughs> look at that we only have 17 uh, 1700 simoleons pretty much um so anyways let's go ahead and check out the inside of the house so if you go here you go in through the front you have like this cute little foyer for for yay i am just saying that completely wrong aren't i anyways so this is the front <laughs> <laughs> and you come in you have like some seating and this cute little guy over here i absolutely love him and or her we come into our small quaint living area i really think it's cute very small really perfect for like that small knit family and you have like a little toy box here and then a radio or stereo karaoke with like this painting on a wall i actually did that i did do a couple tweaks to this house of course um nothing too nothing too major the thing was that uh the kitchen was actually over here and then the dining area was over here i believe so i kind of switched it i didn't like the idea of the kitchen kind of being too close to the back of the house and it was really small It was kind of shaped like a galley kitchen because the counters the sink and all that was like along this wall and then it kind of curved over around here a little bit so i don't know it was really nice the original way was really really nice i really think it's cute and um all that stuff but i really wanted a, a nice you know glamorous kind of kitchen um i wanted the space to be a little bit open it was very boxy um that was i guess the kind of the issue i was having like this area was kind of closed off and then this area was closed off i just kind of wanted it to be just a little bit open i wanted to keep the cabiny feel but still you know keep the original stuff so i added this um little area here and then i rearranged the kitchen i kept the original cabinets the original refrigerator and the stove and all of that stuff so that's what this looks like um i added the flooring and over here i changed the whole flooring throughout the house actually and i added this rug in i did nothing to the living area completely stayed the same basically um i did add this though 
and then if you go around here you have like your bedroom now this area was actually like a office or something like that so i actually placed this bed here so that wendell and miles can be downstairs they can have like you know this whole little bottom area to themselves so i thought that was cute so this is his room here i kind of did this a little bit nothing too extravagant and then i also redid miles room here so he has like a little table and picture frame and another picture and things like that so this is miles little area of um the house and then he and wendell can share like the bathroom that's down here so this is cute the entrance is there and it's kind of separate from the shower area which i do enjoy i really like that a lot so this is the bottom area of the house and then of course this is the back area you guys have already seen that and then upstairs i didn't do anything i got lazy <laughs> just going to be honest um the reason why i got this this lot is because it had this painting easel i was like yes this house is just calling christian's name <laughs> i thought i thought it was so perfect like seriously i downloaded another lot and i was like you know checking them out and i saw this one i'm like yo this has a painting easel they want us to put this in a lot they're like this this lot is for you so I was like, you know what? Let's do it. <laughs> Let's do it. It also had this yellow bed. It was calling for China's name and everything. Not that yellow is probably her color. Who really knows? Like I know a lot of the I know that a lot of the houses that um are being made for this world come with like this weird kind of uh like um wallpaper or something like that is kind of like brown and has like yellow streaks i don't know it's just it's really really weird i don't know i don't like it <laughs> like i just i i have no idea so everybody he wants to relax in a tent of course he does and what is wrong with you voodoo backfire the power of karma compels you to reap what you sow okay so she apparently tried to do something to miles and it just was not working it was a no-go so let's see um acquired the creativity skill oh goodness oh good job christian <laughs> why don't you go ahead and okay well i was just going to tell you to do that sure and he's over here playing with a toy okay he'd rather not be outside with everybody he's like it's cold i don't want to be out here where is christian where is christian where's china oh my god girls you don't get up <laughs> if you do not get your behind up so let's go ahead and see oh my goodness these sims seriously i have no idea what i want to do oh this is so pretty look at this i you know what i'm going to be honest with you guys this is the best um lot i feel like these houses over here i feel are in the best positions like i swear like i lie to you not these this view is freaking amazing i'm such a sucker for views i have said it before i will say it again it's amazing and look at you just enjoying it why don't you come over here and look at cloud gaze with your dad do it <laughs> and let's see hello friends i'm katharina your friendly forest ranger i'm shock full of camping knowledge so if you ever have any questions don't hesitate to ask okay well where are you because i think we will ask Ooh, is she cute um she is okay but um hmm we will have to get to know you i think so we'll go ahead and do a a flirty introduction yes why not so you're going to get warm why don't you go ahead and add a log what are you add, add a log to the fire let's go ahead and see um who miles can uh talk to while we're out here you know this is where freedom reigns okay this is where you don't have no overly attached girlfriend bothering you or anything like that we're in a whole new world <laughs> we are just going to have you know just a little bit of fun we're just going to get to know her just a little bit she's a little old but you know what who cares we can hit that <laughs> oh my god <laughs> I am so horrible. Don't listen to me. <laughs> Let's see. If you need to purchase supplies like a tent or a cooler, go to the ranger station in the campground. Okay, so let's, uh, okay, let's see if we, if we flirt with her. How is she going to take that? Let's sweet talk her a little bit and see if she likes it. Oh, goodness, these girls. He's like, 
Let's let her know that we are an astronaut, okay? We will take you up into space. <laughs> oh, you are just too easy. She's like, what? Space? What? <laughs> Let's talk about our dreams, you know? Because every woman loves a guy who has dreams, right? <laughs> And let's ask her if she's single. Let's blow her a kiss. Um, let's get to know her a little bit. Let's see. Uh, hold up. Who is taking my money? Because we, no. No, this is not going to happen right now. I bet you it's Christian. I cannot leave him alone for five seconds. Okay, let me see. Um, Let's go ahead and get to know her again. And I'm going to go over here. Oh, you want to paint? Okay, you know what? You do that because we need to get our money up and... Since that is there, that's yes. perfect. I thought he was about to make himself some food. I was like, Christian, stop, please. So he's going to go ahead and do that. So she is neat. And she is self-assured. Okay, we're self-assured. That's good. So we have a lot in common already. Awesome. So let's see. We will go ahead and ask her about her day. And... um. <clears throat> Um, let me Rouge. see. What else? We will go ahead and compliment her outfit, but you know, we are going to see who else uh, is around here. And um, let's see, we can click on this. Explore woods, take me to the bathroom, take me to lodging. No. And what? Ah, there's a woodpecker here. Cute. That's really, really cute. Oh, it's so cute. <laughs> That's really, really nice. I love that. Um, let me see. Christian, why are you so orange right now? <laughs> okay, well, when you hurry up and do... When you hurry up. When you hurry up. Okay. Um, I definitely want him to pick up some things for us. And let's go ahead and get that. And China, what are you doing? You are sleeping... What is going on? No, none of you guys are going to be napping. Um, Miles, why don't you come over here? Oh yeah, I forgot to show you guys. So China's room actually has like a little deck on the outside so you can actually kind of chill out here. Okay, so China can go ahead and stay back for right now. And I love this little area over here. So let's see what we can get. Um, let's go ahead and discover some frogs. You know what? China, don't sleep. What is this? chat with zoe why <laughs> why do you want to chat with zoe um we'll have both of them just like collect some things and whatnot uh because i definitely want to and then he can come over here and collect this i'm not sure what was that it's a basil bush nothing exciting and can we dig in the trash can rummage <laughs> Let's go ahead and do that. We'll rummage for food too. Why not? And um, I guess we can go up here and see what else we can get into. So I know with that, Miles is going to get the, the um, what is it? The fishing skill. Who are you? Oh my gosh. He looks like Grady. That is Grady. What in the world? He's like, he came to visit. Oh, how how nice is that, Grady? Let me find out you're following China around. <laughs> Before she was trying to talk to you, you didn't want to have anything to do with her. Let's see. Let's go ahead and collect that as well. Oh, crap. Wait. I forgot to change um, Christian's aspiration. So... Let's go ahead and do that right now before I forget. And it was the nature one. He's supposed to be the outdoor enthusiast. So let's go ahead and see. So he wants to harvest 10 unidentified plants and catch five fish in granite falls. Okay, so let's go ahead and see what Christian is doing. So he's just going to go over here and just dig for a few things. Does that mess up his hygiene? It does. Okay, and what is Wendell doing? Nothing. Oh, so you didn't get anything? Okay. Um, harvest. All right. Well, okay. Well, I can't drag it in there, so I'm not going to worry about it. We ain't do it. <laughs> okay. So, China, you are just so grumpy right now, nauseated from catching frog. The old stomach isn't feeling so good. 
Oh, that's right. So I actually changed up China's traits a little bit as well. So I gave her squeamish. Um, she originally had the perfectionist trait. She had goofball, mean, and perfectionist. Um, I changed out that and just gave her the squeamish thing. There are just a lot of things I'm forgetting because I haven't played in a while. So it makes a lot of sense, actually. Um, let's see. What other plants can we can we find um there's not too many people here right now uh well there are some over here who's this let's see um and she's kind of cute but you know not really and um let's see i want to oh there's another another forest ranger here oh okay i don't know I have no idea where all the plants are for some I think this snow has just covered everything and Grady is over there so why don't we go ahead and send China over here to talk to Grady why not like you know there's a familiar face here and you know what are the odds of you coming here and you know let's give her let's give him some fake bad news um looks like the fish in this area are too crafty for miles um whoops Let's see, deep conversation. Ooh. Oh goodness, the heck was that? Okay, well, she'll go ahead and do that and Christian, let's see, let's get you to collecting some more stuff. I do not want any more basil. I feel like I'm going in circles and I don't know where the plants are. Wild plant, here we go, so that's something. And Wendell, what are you doing? You are playing in the tent. Aww. Oh, look, he has a little flashlight thing. I see it. <laughs> okay, well, he's having fun. That's good. That's always good, as long as he's not bored. Well, why is this sparkling if we can't get it? So it probably can be evolved, and apparently we cannot do that. So why don't we have Wendell and Miles go fishing? So have like a little father and son kind of thing going on, because I think it would be really, really cute. You know, like, I mean, he really wanted to do this for his son. They really wanted to take a trip. And this is so gorgeous. Oh, my goodness. And look at the bird in the background. This is so lovely. This is beautiful. This world. Oh, my goodness. So this helps with his mental skill. How adorable is this? It's so cute. I love it. Let me go ahead and change his outfit. Let's go to two. Oh, this is so perfect. It's so cute. But he's probably going to be a little cold, huh? Let's see. Every day three? Oh my goodness. <laughs> um, let's, okay, that's good. Christian. Okay, so he's like, you know what, forget this. I can't find no plants. I'm just going to go fishing instead. All right, well, that's fine. So while they're doing that, let's go here and Skiba, see how <laughs> um, Grady is doing. And, play. you know, a let's trip. uh get to know him a little and bit. We'll and he is just super we'll strong. Look at him. Look, he just, he looks like a little lumberjack, doesn't he? <laughs> He's like, this is my type of world, girl. Let me tell you. <laughs> oh my goodness. Let's ask about his day. And, um, let's describe a new idea. Um, let's see, what's this? Did I have somebody get this already? Uh. So, Christian, why don't you come over here and grab that, harvest it. And, um, there are like a bunch of plants around here. I don't want to harvest a strawberry bush. Um, oh, there's some more people. Oh, there's that chick again. So, I guess she, um, she got fired for flirting with Miles. <laughs> of course, he would, he would get a girl fired from her job. It's probably, uh... What's the rule? No fraternizing <laughs> while on the job. Um, let's see what else we can find over here. So we have the little bathroom area. And I know there are some plants around here. I just do not know. Strawberry. I don't know their exact whereabouts. So here we have one over there. And how are you doing? You're 10. Stop fishing. Why don't you go here and get that really quickly and um I don't know like where's the rest of the plants at so I feel like I'm forgetting something 
but um we have three days really to you know figure everything out pretty much so anyways i'm going to have wendell do that and then christian you are still collecting he wants to buy an oven while in what buy an oven while inspired that's a weird collect a new postcard and weed a plant well you won't be able to do it in this world and he wants to make a friend i bet you do <laughs> I bet you do want to make a friend, don't you? But let's see. What is that? What? What is that? Oh. Oh. <laughs> I was like, what is going on? Okay, so Miles has to go to the bathroom a little bit. Where is it again? Okay, so it's here. And um, so I guess I'll go ahead and have everybody come back to the lot. Uh. I guess you can go here. She wants to cloud gaze with, with him. So I guess we can go ahead and do that. Oh, okay. So you're just going to go ahead and cloud gaze by the smelly uh -huh. bathroom. True. Okay, go ahead and do that. And Christian, go ahead and head back to the house. And Miles, so you're using the bathroom. You might as well. Don't forget to wash your hands. And, um, oh, was this... Was this already lit? I can't even remember. Was that lit? I don't know. So, let's see. Miles, why don't you go ahead and hang out here and then go ahead and light that. And what in the world is this, veggie dogs? I told you. I knew somebody was over here eating. I bet you it was Christian. I bet you anything. We're going to go ahead and uh throw this out. Where's the kitchen? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Where... I have no idea where nothing is. I'm just going to go ahead and put this in. Never mind. Forget it. Um, can you clean this up, please? And my oh my goodness. I cannot. <laughs> I'm all over the place. Um, Christian, why don't you go ahead and use the bathroom and you know what? I don't trust you. Wash your hands. <laughs> you go ahead and wash your hands too, because I don't I don't trust you whatsoever with that. Um Let's see, um, why don't you go ahead and hang out and where are you? You are just all alone. He's like, I don't know. I don't know where to go. <laughs> um, so he can go ahead and collect that. Is there anything else over here he can get before I send him back to the house? Ooh, what's this? Ah, oh, some bees. So let's go ahead and collect that. And we'll go ahead and get... China. didn't I tell you to go home? See, this is why I told you to go home. You wouldn't have to be dealing with that if I if you just did what I told you to do. Oh, my goodness. Um, So, he definitely needs some social. And if there aren't any more bugs... What's this? A wild plant. Can that be harvested really quickly? It can. But... Get up. <laughs> Why is none of this working? Okay, um, Christian, I hope you wash your- I don't trust you. Go ahead and wash your hands again. You do a little dirty little thing sometimes, I swear. So you can go ahead and- I need to pause this because these sims- I hope someone comes out with a mod that can just alleviate these sims from, uh, trying to sleep every time they see a tent it's just really kind of aggravating because they're not even tired and all they want to do is just sleep in a tent even- a tent even when they have um a full a full uh meter did you did you catch anything no you caught nothing you were useless to me um you're not sleeping so you can come here what the heck happened to the campfire <laughs> goodness can you like this please and hang out and then can you come over here and hang out because I would love for him to tell his son a story and China can you come over here and hang out I I cannot deal with this like these all these sims are just it's just too much Ooh, this is perfect I actually added this to the lot I was like I wonder what this light does can you not <laughs> um go ahead and grill some um let's have Let's have um, some, I'm leaning towards shish kebabs, or yeah, I'm thinking shish kebab. Oh, we need tomato and any fish. Okay, 
Let's go ahead and make some grilled chicken then. Why not? Oh, you know what? Forget it. Why don't we go ahead and make some Franks and beans? You know, it's the way to go. And let's go ahead. Let's uh, have China add to the fire. And our little guy, he is coming a long Shy. way, isn't he? Look at him trying to do tricks. <laughs> Oh, I love it. I love this little, oh, excuse me. <laughs> I love this little thing here. It's like so, oh, how cute. Oh, it's so cute. <laughs> I have never seen this yet. So, it's so cute. I love this little freezer bunny. How adorable is that? That's adorable. I love it. Let's go ahead and play, actually. Where are you? How far away are you? You are just in no urgent way. Like, can you hurry up, please? So, this is cute. I love it. So, I guess once they finish eating and everything, they'll uh, go ahead. Oh, this is another play interaction. I did not see this. That's really cute. That's really, really nice. Wait a minute. Where? Hold up. Where did the food go? So, he just... Okay. Can, can that... Can... Um... <laughs> Okay, so there's no table out here. That kind of sucks. So I'll probably have them purchase one. So why don't you, Christian, call everybody to a meal? So while everybody gets something to eat, oh, look, it's a cute little llama. I love this little light. I think it's cute. And I think it's perfect for like storytelling too. Especially these little swigglies here. I like it. I do. Um, everybody go ahead and eat, you know, Christian put the food on the ground, no big deal. But, um, you know what? This part is kind of dragging on, oh my god. Oh my goodness. Oh no. You had 24 hours to pay your bills before your water is shut off. Oh my goodness. There is, oh my, oh my goodness. And here is Christian just, what? Pause. Hold up. No. Christian, what is going on? <laughs> I can't dis- okay. Extinguish, please. Oh my goodness, like, everybody's running. Yes, China, China and, and, uh, Wendell, just go in the house. Just, just please. Um, you can't, okay. I, they can't do anything. Great. Great. I, I swear, I can't even eat in peace. Um, whoops. <laughs> okay, um. Alrighty, so with that being said, I'm just going to end this part right here. It was just absolutely crazy. Um, I'm sorry about that, but this part has dragged on for way too long, and um, I don't want it to get extremely, extremely long. So anyways, I thank you guys for watching. I hope you all enjoyed, and until my next video, I will see you guys all later. Bye.